Mas ang laki! Oh my gosh! It's also known as Vibalize and welcome to my channel! So today's video is medyo exciting kasi we're going to try out ito, yung mga squad cosmetics. So I have a few here. Papakita ko na lang sa kanila later and some of them kasi na-start ko na katina to. Pero I had to refilm kasi may nakita ko and you know, I had to redo it all over again. Pero yung iba dito may plastic pa. So we're gonna, you know, take that out together. Pero ayun, medyo, alam ko, familiar na kayo sa Scott Cosmetics. Pero ako kasi gusto kong matry sila. And gusto kong um, magawan sila ng honest review. So bumili ako sa Lazada. And ayun, let's try them out together. And I will give you my honest review and thoughts nitong mga to. So, we're not curious kasi ako kasi marami na ako nakita ang posts regarding dito. Maganda daw sila. And at a very, very affordable price, I want to try out kung ano ba yung quality nila and mga ganun-ganun. If you want to know my thoughts and, you know, mga swatches and unboxing ng mga nito, please keep on watching. So, let's start dito sa On The Go Stick and Warm Light. Ito yung parang stick foundation. Um, yung mga binili ko is actually either kailangan ko, hindi ko pa na-try, and um, gusto ko lang i-try. <laughs> Pero yung mga, uh, like yung mga concealer kung mapapansin nyo, wala ako nun kasi meron ako currently sa aking makeup collection. And ayoko kasi yung bumili ng bumili na hindi ko naman magagamit. Pero ito, uh, actually never pa ako nakatry ng stick foundation. Believe, believe it or not, lagi lang akong liquid. This is the um, squad on the stick, on the go stick in warm light. Natanggal ko na yung plastic kasi nga, na, <laughs> inulit ko to, pero ito yun. Tapos nakakatuwa pala sa Squad Cosmetics is, nakalagay dito, they are cruelty free. Amazing, di ba? You know, we love animals and as much as possible, gusto ko talaga supportahan yung mga makeup brands and sa mga brands na ano, cruelty free, di ba? So, anyway, ito na yun. Ito na yung warm light. It's in a plastic container. Ang cute nga eh kasi, ayan no, parang matabang lipstick. And then, this is the shade. So, sana kashade ko siya. Ayan. Pero let's swatch it on my hand. Ayan. This is how it looks like. Layo natin konti. So, yung consistency niya is very creamy. Hindi siya matigas, actually. Which is really nice. Um, in person, it's mas yellow compared to camera. Pero, let's do this. So, I'm gonna use this brush para ikalat yung foundation. Pero, let's see if I need to uh, use a sponge. Pero, for now, let's try the brush. The primer nga muna. First of all, mag primer muna tayo. This is the Skin Liar Primer. I got this from Altea. So far, ito yung pinaka favorite kong primer kasi ano ko, it makes my makeup last longer and smoother. Tapos, and smoother application. It controls my oils. I really love this primer. Let's move on to the stick foundation. So, twist up mo siya. Medyo loose lang yung ganito, yung pag-twist. Wala siya yung maririnig mo na clicks. Pero, kaya pa naman. This is my first time using a stick foundation. So, bear with me kung hindi ako marunong. Mabango siya. May naamoy akong cream na scent. Pero mabango siya. In fairness, ah. Okay, so, blend na natin siya. In fairness, I got the shade that suits my skin tone. So, I'm really happy with that. Dali niya ma-blend. Sobrang dali niya ma-blend. Nakakatawa. Okay, so foundation is done. Sobrang sheer lang ng coverage niya. 
As you can see, par, I still have redness here and here and I still have my blemish here. Um, ayun, so you can see also my dark circles. So it's super sheer na ng coverage. Na. Actually, honestly, I'm not expecting so much sa coverage when it comes to this one. Pero um, on camera, maganda naman yung kanyang, you know, color. Bumagay naman siya sa skin tone ko. And then in person, naka fresh naman siya actually. Parang it does look that I put something on my face. Hindi naman siya yung parang wala lang. Ayun. This is how it looks like. Hindi naman siya patchy. Hanggang, ang ganda na pagka-blend niya sa skin, promise. Wala akong nakikitang streaks or anything. In fairness, ah. So, this is a yes for me kasi, yun nga, ang ganda na pagka-blend niya. Tapos, for a very, very cheap price, maganda na yung performance niya. Para sa akin, eh, initial application. Let's see later ko ano yung performance niya. Okay? So, yes. So, nakapaglagay na ako ng kilay and concealer. Ayan. So, itong gumamit ako ng concealer, gumamit ako ng Ateo concealer, nag-blend naman siya dun sa foundation kanina. As in, maganda yung pagkakablend nila. Hindi yung makikita mo yung uh, part ko saan ako nakapag-concealer. Ganyan. As in, maganda yung pagkakablend nila. Ano to? Or may lump ako dito. So, kung may, kung may concealer kayo, I think magbablend yon with this one. For, ano ah, cream con eto, for liquid concealers. Not sure sa cream concealers, pero I think okay naman kasi, yun nga, parang it melts on your skin naman. So, in next muna natin is etong pressed powder. So, iset lang natin yung foundation kasi, um, you know, <laughs> tatakot ako ba mawala eh. So, this is the you can face it pressed powder in vitamin E. And this is the shade light. Ayan siya. So open natin yung plastic. In fairness, ha, gusto ko yung lalaganan niya. Diba? Parang sobrang kikay lang. And also, mabigat siya. Parang hindi siya yung chippy pa yun na ano, na pressed powder. Medyo, yun nga, it has some weight to it. Which I love. Tapos, ang laki! Oh my gosh! Ang laki niya! Grabe! Kasi, well, Wala yung mirror ko. Pero ang laki niya. Look, oh! And I love the detail ng powder. Ayan, it has some uh, design on it which I love. Grabe! It's so nice! It also has a mirror. Ayan, nakasama dun sa compact. And also, you can uh, buy a refill nito. So, you can reuse this lalagyanan. So, I really love this. Sobrang Hindi siya, ano ah, gusto ko yung bigat niya. So, kuha lang tayo ng powder brush. Ayan. Isiset ko lang yung aking concealer and foundation. So, instantly, nag-mattify yung uh, face ko. Again, it has a very light coverage. I can still see like yung veins ko, yung texture ng face ko, ganyan. At least nag-mattify ang aking face. Let's do a swatch nga. Ayan. Hindi masyadong kita. Pero, if you think na para tayo ng skin tone, definitely get this one. So, ngayon ko lang napansin, yung kasama niyang puff is yung parang sponge. Alam niyo yung binabasa sa salon. <laughs> ito yun. Ayan siya. I was expecting a parang powder puff. Pero ito siya. Sponge siya. And so far, okay naman. It, um, nag-crease siya dun sa, ano ko, under eyes. Hindi pa naman siya, hindi naman siya cakey or anything. Which I am happy about. So far, so good. Let's move on to eyeshadows. Okay, so I went ahead and put eyeshadow primer and tinali ko muna yung buhok ko. 
Because <laughs> I eat it. So, anyway, let's go ahead and use the eyeshadow. So, this is the Peach Squad Eyeshadow Palette. And ito yung pinili ko kasi ang cute ng colors. Very, very me. Ito yung mga sinusuot ko. So, let's go ahead and take off the plastic. Ito yung itsura niya. Ayan. So, clear yung case. Yung, yung weight niya medyo magaan. And we have 3, 6, 9 shades. And this is what they look like. So, walang um, specific shade names per shade. Pero, in its um, entirety, ito yung Peach Squad Eyeshadow Palette. So I went ahead and swatched them. Ayan sila. So pahita ko lang sa inyo close up ko na itsura nila. Sunod sunod yan. Top row, second row, and then last row. Starting from here. Ayan siya. Ayan. So kung ano yung napansin ko is that for the matte shades, medyo chalky yung pigments but for the shimmer shades like this one this one uh these sobrang ganda ng color payoff nila i love the shine but for uh, like these two this one this one ito maganda yung color eh but uh, these medyo nakukulangan ako sa color nila and medyo chalky yung mga matte shades um, lahat ito, one swipe lang. Um, ginanon, well, two. Dalawang beses na rub. And then, one swipe. Ayun, yun yung ginawa ko sa kanila lahat. Ayun, so far, medyo chalky yung matte shades. If you don't know what, what it means kapag sinabing chalky, I will show you. So, let's try this shade. Ayan. So, kung makikita nyo, parang... Parang yun nga, chalky siya. <laughs> Parang siyang chalk. Ayan, kung makikita nyo. Ayan, medyo may pagka buo-buo siya minsan. Ayan. So, I have here the Skin Potions Jet Setter Palette. Um, pumili din ako ng local na palette kasi, syempre, you know, para lang fair. Pero later, sabihin ko sa inyo kung gawa yung Squad Cosmetics. So, I'm just gonna use itong Perth na shade. Ayan. And then, watch how it swatches on my skin. Ayan. As you can see, wala siya yung parang buo-buo na parang chok. As in, buong-buo siya. Ayan, oh. Walang, walang chalky feeling. Tapos, hindi siya madulas. Ayan. So, isa-set ko lang muna yung aking eyeshadow primer using a, a neutral shade. So, let's just use this one. Tsaka, when it's chalky, pag gumamit kayo ng brush, ang daming fallout. Ayan o. Kita nyo? Ang dami. So, anyway. Ay! Nasa shorts ko. Anyway, let's use this. Pero in fairness ha, kita pa rin naman yung color. Parang opaque pa din naman siya. And so far, wala akong nakikita, nakikita ang fall off sa face ko. So, ito siya. So, kahit uh, nag-tap off na ako na excess, yan o, oh, kita pa rin siya. Maganda pa rin yung color um, outcome sa mata ko. And then, gagamitin ko tong shimmerish goldish, rose gold shade. Shade. Ayan. And then, I will just put it on top of my eyelid. 
Ayan o, oh, ang ganda ng color payoff na shimmer shades nila. I really love it. Kita nyo? It's so nice. So, sulit yung palette for the shimmer shades. Ang ganda. So, like I said, gustong-gusto ko yung payoff, yung color payoff no ano, shimmer shades. Ayan, kahit malayo, kitang-kita nyo pa rin siya. Ang ganda. Wala pa lang salami. <laughs> Ang ganda niya, promise. Like, in person, kitang-kita mo talaga siya. Pero, yung um, pagka-shimmer niya, medyo malalaking glitters. So, for the outer corners, gusto ko muna mag-start dito sa so parang reddish uh, orange shade. Ayan, yung ganyang shade. Para, you know, may konting pop of color. So, dito lang siya sa labas. In fairness ha, sobrang pigmented niya. Kamaya oh, i-blend na lang natin siya. And then, gamitin natin tong shade na to just to blend the outer parts of that red color. Ito lang magiging. Ito lang magiging. Ito lang magiging. Medyo, it's out there, pero mamaya, maayos yan. Wait lang kayo. So, ayan sila. I think may parts na feel ko medyo patchy. And nahirapan ako mag-blend. Pero, ayun lang. Maybe it's me. Maybe it's the eyeshadow palette. I'm not sure. Talagyan na lang din natin yung lower lash natin. Nung red na part. And then, lalagyan ko ng um, this color. Ito. Dun sa in outer corners pa para mas mag-deepen pa yung eyes natin. So, ito. It looks like a dark brown. Pero when I use it, nagiging orange. Ayan na. As you can see. So, Hopefully, ma-darken niya yung eyeshadow sa gusto kong shade. Medyo nahihirapan ako sa matte shades. Kasi, like ito, naging orange. And then, yung red, medyo patchy. Anyway, mamaya, tatry natin siya isalba using the contour palette. So, for this one, I can tell, I can say na for the shimmer shades, yes, it's a yes for me. For the matte shades, medyo may struggle ako sa kanya. And I've used many palettes na rin naman. So, medyo may credibility naman ako when it comes to palettes. When, when it comes to eyeshadow palettes. So, Ayan lang naman. Medyo. So, unahin na natin to. Um, yung squad contour blush. And chin up. Ayan. So, let's open up the plastic. And so, it has four shades. And ito yung sasabi ko na Sana ma-darken na niya yung eyeshadow ko. Kasi right now, it looks very um, neon. <laughs> Ayan. So, let's swatch this. So, this is the darker shade. Ayan. Yung ganyan yung hinahanap ko. And this is... Ooh. Medyo sheer and chalky yung blush shade. For the highlighter. Uh, medyo kinulang. Very light lang yung highlighter niya. I don't know if you can see it. Ayan. And then this one, I think, is another contour slash bl blush shade. And medyo blush nga siya. It's this one. So, let's use the dark shade <laughs> for our eye makeup. So let's just use that. And also, you can use this as your eyeshadow palette and as well as your, you know, blush and contour. Ayan, medyo dark na. That's what I want. 
Thank you for saving my life. Yeah, medyo nag-darken na siya. Although, still having the same struggle when it comes to the patchiness. And medyo mahirap siya i-blend. Normally, I don't have any problems with eyeshadow. Pero, I can definitely say for this one, medyo nagsa-struggle ako. Ayan. This is the best I can do. So, ayan. I think I fixed it. Um, nag-blend pa ako and naglagay pa ako ng uh, nito. Ayan. So, naglagay na rin ako sa lower lash. Ito sa gilid. So, hopefully, it is better. I really hope so na it's better. Pero, gusto ko lagyan muna yung lower lashes ko. Gusto ko lagyan nito ulit. I love this shade. Para lumaki lang yung mata ko. Okay. There you go. Let's move on to eyeshadow. <sighs> Stress ako to sa matte shades. Okay, next is blush and contour. So actually, I have another one. Is itong duo, duo blush and highlighter in the shade pair. Actually, gusto ko matry. And so let's swatch this one. Ooh, ito hindi siya chalky. I love it. Ah, uh, so so ba? Ito na lang. And siya, it's a little patchy, but less chalky nung kanina. And and then let's try the highlighter shade. Medyo mas maliit yung highlighter. And lasa siya dong amoy. Uh, highlighter is lacking. Not liking the highlighter. Maybe para everyday, everyday ano lang siya. Highlighter thing. So gumitin na lang natin siya dalawa. So, yung lighter shade. Stop that here. Tap off the excess and put blush. Lightan lang natin yung blush natin kasi. It's real dramatic na yung eyes. Naging dramatic yung eyes natin. Okay. Okay naman yung blush. Kito mo naman yung pigment niya. And let's just blend it out. Let's take the gun at in konti na tong darker one. Okay, so let's move on with highlighter. So I'm gonna use this brush and let's use this. I freaking take that back. <laughs> Kita pa na siya. I was too harsh. I'm sorry. Pero kita pa na siya in fairness. Medyo chunky yung glitters niya, pero at least you have a highlighter. When I meant na chunky yung glitters. And you can see na ganyan siya. And or at least you have a highlighter. Let's try the other shade. This one. I'm gonna use the other part of my brush. One, two. Okay. I'm convinced it's definitely a highlighter. Pero like a chunky highlighter. Okay, so let's move on with lips. Actually, I have three products with uh, lips. So I have the Lip Oil Multi-Purpose Mousse Cream in Gleeful. And I have this lipstick in Power. So swatch natin sila isa isa. And definitely, I will just use one for today. Kasi, syempre, I have only one pair of lips. Itong lip oil... Natry ko na to kagabi, na swatch ko na siya actually. It's literally a, an oil. Hindi siya lip gloss. You know, oil, oil yung texture niya and magbabago agad yung color niya. It will definitely stain my lips. So, hindi ko muna to try yan. Uh, this one is the multi-purpose mousse.
Bango ng oil. Bango siya. So, ito yung shade ng mousse. Ooh, I love it! I love it! Ang ganda nung ano niya. Nung formula niya. Ayan o. It's so nice. Gusto ko rin yung wand niya. Medyo flexible. Medyo flexible yung wand. And then, since it's multi-purpose, try natin mag-blend. Ooh, ang ganda. May kanting amoy din yung mousse. Pero not too overpowering. Ayan o, oh, it's so nice. Ang ganda niya, in fairness. And last but definitely not the least is this lipstick. I love the packaging ng lipstick kasi paper siya. Ah, medyo ano tayo. Environmental friendly. You know, ang ganda. It's made out of paper. Tapos may metal... I mean, may plastic pa rin naman sa loob. Ooh, in fairness ha, madami na yan. And close-up ko na lang kayo kasi I really love yung mga bagong lipstick na itsura. Okay, this is the shade Power. And it looks really nice. So, swatch natin siya. Ooh, it's very creamy. So, ito yung mga swatches na lip products. And for my look, I think I will use the shade. And I think mas bagay siya sa eye makeup ko. Mmm, it's so nice. It's so creamy. Sobrang dali, sobrang nag-glide lang siya sa lips ko. I love it. Grabe. For the others, I will post them on Instagram and, you know, let you know my thoughts. So make sure to follow me on Instagram, ha? Because, you know, I'm gonna do that all there. I'm just gonna put on some eyeliner. And we still have one last product to try. So wait lang. So lastly, we have this Uplift water <laughs> Waterproof Mascara. So let's open this up. In fairness, ang ganda talaga ng packaging ng squad. I love yung parang French detailing chuchu nila. So let's just curl my lashes and use the mascara. Oh, look! Ang laki ng wand. Pakaiba yung wand niya. Oh. Parang you have the flat side. Well, it's flat. Ayan. <laughs> Hindi siya round brush. And yung bristles niya is, ano, plastic. Medyo nakakatakot yung plastic brush. Pero, in fairness, it works. Hindi siya nakaka-clump na eyelashes, which I love. Let's do the bottom bottom lashes. I'm gonna use this side, yung medyo curved side. Gusto ko yung design ng wand. Kasi naabot niya talaga yung lower lashes ko. Kasi sobrang ikli lang talaga niyan. So, ito yung difference nila. This is with the mascara and this is yung wala. Okay, we're done. Here is what it looks like. Ayan siya for Squad Cosmetics. Ayan. In fairness, um, pagkaganda siya. Pero there are things na I've struggled with. For the mascara, I think hindi lang ako sa nanay. Pero it did combed my lashes very nicely so hindi siya na clump and everything but ayan siya this is what it looks like i've said my thoughts nung nilalagay natin yung makeup but what do you guys think i will wear test this for a couple of hours and then i will check back with you later but for now this is what it looks like ayan siya and 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 so guys i will be right back we'll wear test this for today and, ayan. Hey guys, so it's been an hour since nung nag-film ako. As you can see, naka-mask ako kasi I had to go somewhere and buy something. So, ito siya, ayan. <laughs> so this is after one hour. And then, ito yung lipstick. Then sa nung naka-mask ako. And then, where's my mirror? Ganyan pa naman siya. Bumakat ng yung tissue sa nose ko, pero buo pa naman. Hmm. 
Hey guys, so it's been several, several, several hours because I'm <laughs> tired. And right now it has been around four to five hours. <laughs> okay, so the makeup looks smooth, but then wow! As you can see, I am major nag oil up lang konte on the nose part, but the makeup looks really good still like my eye makeup ang ganda pa rin niya i mean with the blending situation and all yung blush ko nandiyan pa wow it's really nice if you're a beginner or um you're on a budget or students ganyan i definitely recommend tong squad cosmetics because so far how it performs maganda naman siya it just takes a little you know blending and also look at my lippy it's still there uh, I ate an egg pie kanina and look still here you know guys so I need to take the makeup off now cuz I'm running out of sunlight and I will do my ano pa, a live stream behind mama yeah that's kanina and lang so say goodbye to the makeup Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and let me know your thoughts regarding the Squad Cosmetics. If you've tried them, if you have any comments about these, let me know what you think about my makeup and if you really did enjoy this video. So thank you guys so much for watching. Please, please subscribe if you're not subscribed yet and click that bell notification para you know when I upload. And then, please like this video if you liked it. And please don't forget to comment down below because I really try and read all of your comments as much as I can because I love reading your comments. It makes my heart full. And you know, guys, don't forget to follow me on Instagram and on Facebook. And yeah, I will see you in the next video. Bye!